today I'm going to teach you about how to use categories on your WordPress website. First of all, there are two ways that you can add categories on your site. The first way is to navigate to your post and click on one of your posts that you've created or while you're actually working on a post, you can do this as well. You can navigate over to the right hand side where um, you see the, the title categories. You can click add new category and add um, the name of your newest category to the list by simply typing it in and pressing add new category and you'll see it appear at the top. Now, the second way to add categories is to navigate to your left hand sidebar menu. You'll look for all posts, I'm sorry, posts and then categories. And this is gonna take you to where you can create all the categories one by one in one central location. Once you create the category, you can go in, you can see the one I just made over there, you can go in and you can add some details to that page. So for instance, you can create a headline, you can add media, and you can add text so that it appears on the top of your page, your archives page. So now you can go ahead and update that and we'll see how it appears on the category page. You can see now here, I, this is where I had headline is here and here's an example of some text. Now you'll see that nothing matches the criteria, which means that I haven't selected anything to, uh, or any post to show in this category. So that is how you create a category in two different areas on your WordPress site and how you can add some text. And again, you can even add an image there in the edit category section right here, add media. Now, the next thing you can do with categories is you can add them to your menu bar. So as you can tell, all of these categories have been added. And the way to do that, all you have to do is click categories, little arrow. And as you can see, the recipe category isn't showing. So you might need to push view all and then you'll see it appears. We're gonna select the recipes and add it to the menu. Now keep in mind, you may want to check off a different menu and select that menu for your new category to show under. So make sure here in this tab that you've selected the menu that you would like the category to show under. And then don't forget to always click Save Menu. And now we can go back and see where our recipe has now been added. And just like I wrote in the post, sometimes this doesn't work. And that's because we have a server side cache that would have to be cleared in order for this to appear. So if you run into the issue that we just did, you wanna make sure that you wanna clear your cache, clear your caching plugin or your CDN or even your browser. After your cache is cleared, you should see that new category appear up top and you can click on it and see now we have a post. I went in and selected a post for that category. You can see the headline, the text, and that post that's within that category. And that's it, that's how you use um, categories on your WordPress site.